Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Pookie here. Alright, today's video I'm going to teach you how to get zero cash through your XBMC and that, so hopefully this will stop all your buffering and that. Um, I believe the reason why it caches a lot of times is because XBMC is set to cache the video memory to the RAM rather than the um, the hard drive, so what that does if your RAM is not sufficient enough in your device, um, it won't obviously play your streams quick enough. Obviously it's hard to do with how many people are on the streams as well, how much traffic's on there, but it can be a, a, a bit of both. So just to try and stop this from happening, what you need to do is you will need to add the Xfinity add-on. Now if you've, sorry, the Xunity add-on, I call it Xfinity, but it's called Xunity. Um, so what you'll need to do is you'll need to go to File Manager and then go to Add Source. In the URL, you'll want to put HTTP colon forward slash forward slash Xfinity dot Xunity talk dot com. And you're going to click Done. Call it XUnity or XFINITY, whatever you want to call it. I have a habit of calling it a few different things. So yeah, just click done and click OK. No, I'm, I'm not going to add this because I've already added it before. So you just click OK. So once you've done that, you want to head over to settings. You're going to go to add-ons. You're going to go to install from zip file. And you're going to want to go down to XFINITY. That's the one we've just created. So when you click on that, you want to go down to XUnity Talk Repository right at the bottom. And in the bottom right hand side, we should have added and enabled. So now we want to go up to Get Add-ons. We're going to go to XUnity Talk Repository, the one we've just added. We want to go down to Program Add-ons. And we want to put, um, click on XUnity Maintenance. <coughs> and then we want to install that. Sorry, I'm getting a bit of a dry throat. So, once X Unity Maintenance has gone on and installed, I'm going to come back out of it. Now this will be under your Programs tab. So if you go into Programs, X Unity Maintenance. As I, with all this here, you can just leave this all normal, so just click OK. And then it will bring you to this. So what you'll need to do from here is you'll just need to go down to Tweaks. And then you want to go to Add Zero Cache. Now, as I say, you can add any of these ones here, but just for the video, we're just going to put add zero cache, XML. And you say, maybe back to the originals. Now, to be a perfect learner, you won't need to because this is just going to make things run smoother. So just click yes, then click OK. You will have to restart Code your XBMC once you've done this for it to take effect, but as I say, come back out of it all. Just turn it off and reset. So yeah, I hope this video helped you guys, and uh, if this video did help you, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, peace out.